helps if I unmute and set up my microphone. Hello, everybody. Hello. I decided at the last possible second to go live. So I'm still technically setting up. Give me just a second. Um, just a second. Um, all right. Let's put Discord there. Open up the game. Which is technically open, but... Okay, now why... There it is. Why isn't... Come on, headphones. I know you have a short in you, but come on. Are you good? I think we're good. Yes, we're good. Okay. Now let me set up my phone. How y'all doing? I hope y'all are doing all right. Um, I am late today, obviously, like half an hour late, and you know what? I don't have an excuse. <laughs> I don't. I just, uh, uh, <laughs> you know, um, all right, uh, let's open up that. There we go. Minimize, min minimize, open this. There we go. There we go. All right. How's battery? Battery 79 still. Okay. Open. Open. There we go. You know what? Let's swap over to Discord. Eh, eh, 
Eh, eh, eh, eh, eh. Okay. Wait, where am I? I didn't say to go to Instagram. I said Discord. Sorry, my phone is weird. All right. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Um, officially, welcome to uh, Crimson Plays Assassin's Creed. Now, you may note, if you could see on this small screen here, um, that... Hold on, why? What is happening? Whatever. My keyboard's being weird. Um, the uh, You may note, if you could see, I don't know. I deleted the save file from last week. That was not an accident. It was intentional. Um, because, oh my god, I got so pissed off and so frustrated with all of the technical difficulties I was having um, that I decided, fuck it, we're starting over. Um, I'm not going to try to recreate the exact thing, but, you know, I'm going to largely do essentially the same, you know? Um... But the, uh, I'm still gonna try to talk about all the same things. Like when I, I did a little bit of talking about Aveline and the Abstergo news, uh, not news, uh, lore about um, the ga the in-universe games and things like that, that they don't exactly explain, but leave to context clues and stuff like that. Um, but hopefully, I think I figured out why I was having the technical difficulties with all the with the game crashing constantly and all of that. It should be fixed. Uh, the game is not going to be nearly as pretty as it was because I'm pretty sure that it's my graphics card saying, I don't like the settings you have, have me on. So, oh well. What matters is the game is played, not that it's pretty, which kills me inside because I love... I. I I, I have this thing as a, like, my, I'm the gamer who, like, has a has a tough time playing a game if it's not at, if I can't have it at the ultra set, uh, ultimate set, at the maximum, thank you, that's the word, maximum settings. Um, not that I don't ever do that, don't ever play games that aren't not on ultimate uh, maximum settings, but just because, like, the whole time I'm thinking this could, look, this game, Imagine what it would look like blah 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 oftentimes. There's not much of a difference because I it's not like I have a shit tier graphics card, you know um, But so normally it's not like there's much of a difference, but in my brain. I'm still going <laughs> Anyway before we get started, uh, let me talk to let me talk to you about my link tree, which has my Patreon in it. Patreon.com slash Crimson Knight spelled exactly like my uh, Twitch uh, Twitch name. Um, if you go there and you, you can support me much more directly than through Twitch. Um, not that I don't appreciate anybody who supports me on Twitch. Why am I so dark even though my ring light is on? That's the wrong button. There we go. Uh... Not that I don't support you if you uh, support you. Not that I don't appreciate you if you support only support me through Twitch or whatever, or even just view me. Well, view? English is going to be hard for me today. Let's just accept that. Um, not that I don't appreciate you. Otherwise, but it is still just a an extra little thing. You know, anyway, it's not necessary. It's not required. You still get access to all my streams and vids and all that. Um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Nothing is locked behind a paywall. Because I love you all. Anyway. All right. Can I think of anything? Nope. We're good. Let's get started. All right, so mouse the noob as a reminder for anybody who didn't see last uh, last week's stream as i was rambling um or who are only catching this one uh or seeing this on youtube because this one this version is the version that's going up on youtube um canonically the noob is the name of the character you play in the modern day of this game. So what is, so, you know, how in previous games, uh, 
specifically Assassin's Creed 1, 2, 3, etc. When you put your name in, it would default to Desmond because you were playing as Desmond Miles accessing his ancestors' memories. So, but in this game, they introduce a new modern day character, the noob. Um, is the only name we get for him because he's supposed to be a self-insert for the player. Which is why it's so vastly different than in previous games. Um, and I think that's an interesting concept. But anyway. Ubisoft presents. And there's a man in a hood. On it, Captain. All right, now for the tutorializations. Not that I need them because I've played this game so much in the past that I have them memorized. But also I only did this just last week. I mean, they're not all alone. So, Mr. Sean Pertwee, you need to uh, get get your character's eyes checked. And that's how you use fire barrels. Come into range. Already did. Oh, hey, the queen's watching. Hey, how you doing, queen? Is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. Why well, not sail with the king's navy? Earn a proper way, sail under gentlemen. Sod the navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets six hundred. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. It's not about need, Caroline. I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. How long would you be gone with these privateers? A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. No more than two. Promise me. How about me? I'm doing all right. Uh, remind me what trips you're getting ready for again. And yes, yes, we've officially hit the pirate game of the Assassin's Creed series. So yes, 
pirate theme all over the fucking place. Yar har fiddle dee dee. Do what you want because a pirate is free. You are a pirate. Come on. Why am I not? Oh, I guess I can't run. Oh, right, right, right. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Assassin. Was it good for you as well? <laughs> I must get to Havana. No, no, no. Build us another ship, will I? I can pay you. Isn't that the sound you pirates like best? One hundred esquivos. Keep talking. Will you or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? <laughs> Bloody fucking pirates! <laughs> I'm on to you, Sneaksby! Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. I love that. I really do love that he calls him Sneaksby. Sorry, I'm just, you know, ignoring the destination to comb the beach looking for any kind of uh, collectibles or pickups. Don't mind me. Not seeing anything. All right. You know what? Yeet! What you want, cause a pirate is free. You... Ooh! Body! Just loot you real quick. Okay, so that's where I came in over there. Can I climb back up or do I have to go around? I think I have to go around. Oh wait, nope, I can climb up over here. I mean, he might. He's a fucking assassin. Sorry, I got something stuck in my teeth. I don't... What was I doing? Right, this way. <laughs> I 
Yar har fiddle dee dee. Do what you want, cause the pirate is free. You are a pirate. I really Edward while he's not my f while he's not my favorite character in the Assassin's Creed series he is up there like his voice actor is one of my favorites um because the voice actor for Edward Kenway is um the guy who plays John Constantine in the ser in the TV series Constantine and also uh, uh, the Arrowverse. The shows like Arrow and The Flash and etc. And that actor is just gen gen genuinely God, English is hard. Um just genuinely one of my favorites. Cause he plays this kind of character really fucking well. And he's got such a good voice. Yar har fiddle dee dee. Ah, this is where I'm looking. Looking for. Right over here. Yo. Ho. All hands. Boys, the colors high. Thieves and beggars Never shall we die Button, there we go Alrighty Here, up, up, and we okay. Drop, drop it, Edward. Thank you. Ever shall we die? Out. All right, let's skin this critter. Uh, hit this. Come on. All right, now there's a chest nearby that I'm not seeing easily. Ah, it's up there. Okay. work together on this
All right, let's see what do we got here. Where, where? Hmm. Pigo. Pigo? Into Pigo. I love that it had him kill him, kill the pig with the uh, wrist blades that he doesn't even have yet. Did that with Connor too a couple of times. to self don't sing while in the while trying not to belch it does weird things to your voice oh. all righty let's see here Rude. All right. Yeah, I'm going to ignore you for a second. So I want to come over here. Oh, is it going to desync me? Yeah, it's desyncing me. Rip. Silly game. Yes, silly game. Okay, hold that thought, Edward. Sorry, I, I put in, I'm gonna put some on my limonada in my cup now. All right. All right. Allons-y. I'll just have to backtrack for that chest eventually. Bum, ba -da -da -dum, bum, bum. <laughs> Get fucked, assassin. Senor Duncan Walpole, I accept your most generous offer and await your arrival with eagerness. If you truly possess the information we desire, we have the means to reward you handsomely. Though I will not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Su más humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. And time to backtrack. Come on. 
and thus Edward gets his ow. That was weird. Um, and thus Edward gets an assassin's outfit. I love that he yeeted the fucking uh, hidden blades into the bushes. <laughs> like, bruh, you don't know how useful and powerful those things are. Those things will kill most anybody instantly. Okay, fine. Do the thing. All right. Over here, up here, run over here, pick up this. Piggy, 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 piggy. Piggy? Aminals everywhere. Okay. Excuse me. All right. Let us go over this way. Um, ba da da dun dun dun. Alrighty. They'll explain what this is, what I'm about to do later. Um, so, you know, I'm not too worried about explaining it right now because they will genuinely explain it uh, later on. It's a story beat and I'm just doing it now so I don't have to worry about doing it later. Right? This is a nice this is a one of the uh, nicest assassins outfits. It's really dirty at the moment. Um because I just killed a guy in it. <laughs> um but the uh I it is my Hold on, let me think about this. I think it's my third favorite assassins outfit. I think. Um the version that Edward gets in... Well, okay, I think it's actually tied for third. Because I think it's this one and Connor's... Um, are my are tied for third. Um, but not specifically this version of it. But uh, Edward, after, uh, after a bit into the game, he customizes it a bit. Um, like, he puts some leather armor on top of it and things like that. Um... And when he when it's gotten when he's customized it to be his, it actually looks really really good. Um, and I think that that's when it's my, uh, when it uh, that version of it is my. Oh, that didn't work. Edward, come on. Come on, give me the sea shanty. Come 
Come on, 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 come on. No, 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 no. Yes. Okay. Um, yeah, to finish what I was saying, I think that... Hey, Rose, good to see you. I think that this version is this, uh, not this version, but uh, this assassin's outfit is my third favorite. Tied with Connor's, I think. Um, Aveline's is my second favorite. And uh, Evie Fry's is my favorite favorite. If I, from what I'm remembering, it's been a while since I've seen most of them. Uh, so I'm not, I'm probably not, I may be forgetting one. Piggy. Okay, fine. How are you doing, Rose? Yeah, Connor's was pretty great. Is the hey, hey. Oh, it's down there. Okay. That would be why I can't see it. Uh, how about this one? But also down there? Yeah, it's down there. Okay. Uh, now you. Where are you? Oh, you're right over here. Piggy, 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 piggy. All right, give me just a second. I need to mess with some Discord stuff. There we go. Come on. There you go. Ouch. Alrighty, now then, start with you. Okay, you're actually up from here. Okay, so this one's a level up. The Both of them are levels up. Damn it, okay. Can I, nope, okay. that's everything that's currently available there you go bound her in her bones alright now so that I don't have to if I remember correctly,
Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, that is down there. Yes, that is correct. Okay. There is... Yes, here it is. Yeet. Yeah, 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 yeah. St stealthy, t stealth tutorial. Okay. Havana. Havana, na na na. Maybe I don't have it. I have the treasure map yet, but I know that there's a thing here. Maybe I need to get the treasure map first. All right, I'll do that in a second. Uh, yeah, there's the treasure map. Okay. Look at this. One chest left and one secret left. Okay, easy peasy. Fine. You saw nothing. You didn't see anything. Oh, look at the turtle. Tortoise. Tortoise? Tortoise? Turtle. Turtle, I think. Sea turtle. Yes. Go to sleep. You see nothing. Definitely not anything worth investigating. Okay. Now then. If I remember... Which I don't apparently remember. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. The sword's away, can we? I wasn't sure th that somebody's doing some yard work or something outside uh, and I wasn't sure if it was I was like why is there a fucking uh, I think it's a weed eater I'm hearing it's like why is there a fucking weed eater in this game <laughs> I don't remember ever noticing that before that's an anachronism shit <laughs> but no it's not in the game it's in it's in my backyard well, neighbors, but yeah. Havana, na na na. Take my sugar. Take All right, like. let's bypass them for a second. Come over here and interact with this. 
Interact with the dead body. Just pat it down. Give it a good old feely. Yep, yep, yep. Treasure. Uh-huh. I know exactly where this goes. You can tell I played this game so enough times that I remember where this exact treasure map goes to. <laughs> All right, it's not that one. No, this one. All right. Yeah, get up. Oh, oh. All right. Dude, you could put the sword down when doing that. Shit. All righty. All right, now we can leave the bl this blasted place. Take my sugar. Take anything you like. Come here. Oh, I'll pay you. Anything you like. You saw nothing. Okay, you saw something. By God's grace, you saved me. <clears throat> Thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its fortune, <coughs> and I, uh, I can pilot her myself. No mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name? <laughs> Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the King, God save him, and I must get to Havana with speed. Oh, that is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies. Havana, na na na. Uh, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. But all things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? I love him. <laughs> Lacking a rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my... Hardly the worst thing to happen. Agreed, hardly the worst thing to have to happen. Oh, look at him struggle to swim. Oh, oh, this bit is difficult. I should have taken the coat off. <laughs> Fellas? All right, Steed. Let's go. Set the main spree. Welcome aboard, Duncan. She's a modest schooner, but well suited to my purpose, trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to full, shall we? Havana, na na na. Da 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 And fish. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. We've really opened it up now, haven't we? <laughs> Those sailors were quite animated by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes, that is a bustling strait. But I shouldn't worry about being waylaid by pirates, truth be told. My ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. 
There's not a pirate living who turned his back on a keg of rum. Oh, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. Not helping his anxiety there, Edward. Natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness. I... I do love their friendship, even though he treats him like shit at the start. Welcome back. Well, your numbers look good. Now let's make sure we didn't break your brain, all right? Hmm. I love the little soft nod. These lights just here. Look up. That's it. Down. So far, so good. Let's get you up. So, welcome to the Sample 17 project. Before you get started, you're gonna need this. There you go. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, bonjour. C'est bon? It works? Yep. You're good. I can hear you. Even though you're standing right in front of me. All right. Let's take a walk. Your file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, which is surprising. You're very good. The data streams are very stable. We got Edward on the left and Aveline on the right. Yeah, I'm coming. First floor layout. Have you ever been to Chicago? Once. Well, the Chicago Heights, actually. I drove through it. I'm thinking about moving there after my visa runs out here. You American? Yeah. I have a few friends working for Bloom down there. I think that's where you run off to. Hardware, infrastructure. I'm just not happy here, really. Aw, good. Abstergo is trash. Bloom isn't much better. You actually met this guy, John, the one down in IT? Yeah, I think so. He's super Hello. arrogant. Did you get lost? Hey, thank you for the follow. But yeah, Bloom Corporation, if you've watched my Watchdog stream on Wednesdays, or every other Wednesday, technically, is uh, is uh, the antagonist organization in that. Impressive, right? This building yes. is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, since 2010. His maternal grandmother's mother was Asian. Sounds confusing. Oh, I suppose so. Uh, Maybe you saw Liberation? That was our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just the tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course. Edited versions of real history. But only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature. Caribbean Pirate. So that's your gig. Okay. It'll just take a minute, okay? Okay. Oh, sorry. Well, thank you, Nancy. I like... Bon journée. I like your little bag. C'est bon. Tout est prêt. Magnifique. Merci. This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. Oh. 
You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because <coughs> Excuse me. I'll read that later. First game by Abstergo Entertainment using the memories of of exper and experiences of Aveline de Grand Prix was Liberation. Oh, you got muffins and coffee. Can I have an espresso, please? No? Please? Fine, jerk. Just stand there ignoring me. Rude. This place is... Gorgeous! Look at this building! Architecture. An elevator surrounded by an aquarium. That is fucking a lot. It means you're hooked up to the elevator. Yes. I'll let you do the honors. We're headed up to the Sample 17 studio. Second floor. Okay. And enter. You ready? Let's go. Mm -mm. Okay, fine. Ah, there's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Have you met our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hayden, Connor... Edward, the pirate. Ah, arr, yarr, matey. <laughs> Very exciting. Welcome aboard. Yikes. Evelyn, can we talk in your office for a minute? Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in five minutes. C'est bon. Nice to meet you. Oh. Uh, you Rose doesn't know what to do for dinner. Um, sushi. Order sushi. We're diving into the memories of one. I don't know why sushi's on my brain. Probably because of the aquarium. Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from his DNA, and hopefully one day we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing. Calibrating. Calibrating. Right. So here we are. Your very own Animus workstation. This is all yours. So sit back. There's vegetarian sushi. If you need any vegetarian sushi is really good, actually. It's the only sushi I eat. So you'll have no problems. And I'll check in on you later. Happy pirating. Okay. I hope you don't mind me stalking you around a little bit before I get started, Melanie. Let's look around. I love that they have a big ass box that's just copy paper. But yeah, Rose, there's vegetarian sushi. It's really good. So basically what she said and has implied, there's Edward in his glory. Shit, look at him. Uh, is that Abstergo has taken the Animus technology and created a game, a VR game console out of it, uh, in which people, um, in which people take the, uh, his, the act in which Abstergo t uh, takes the memories of actual people who they call donors but uh, we know because we've played as Desmond Miles, who was Subject 17, that they take the samples by force if they, uh, if they have to. Um, but uh, they take those memories, edit them into gameplay, like we saw in Assassin's Creed Liberation. Um, they edit out any references to the Templars, um, paint the assassins as losers and the whole, as, and, stuff and focus on characters who tend to not be quote unquote the ideal assassin type of a thing like uh edward um and aveline 
uh, there's points where she argues with her mentor and they edited out the parts where they actually reconciled and she stayed as a proper assassin, you know? Um, and they focused on and they edited them to emphasize the, the, the conflict between her and her mentor. Um, but, uh, yeah, they've been, and they released this to the public to view, um, to be able to re experience these edited memories as a way of, uh, editing and whitewashing history while also making profit and things like that. Um, and I am in their midst. So yeah, pick up this sticky note here with the QR code on it. All right, let's see where I can go. I, let's go back downstairs, shall we? Back down to the lobby, come on. And yes, Rose, Yvonne is a, uh, is a connoisseur of all things sushi. So she is a very good source of information. God, I love, I love this building so much. Abstergo, you guys have style. You may be evil assholes, but y'all have fucking style. Bet this place is hell to, uh, to, uh, to keep alive though. All right. Security level three. Oh, another sticky note. All right, I'll read all the sticky notes at once when I have them all, which will be later. Uh... Do, 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 do. I think it's really clever how the HUD and map in this game are your PDA or your tablet or whatever, you know? It, I, th I think it's clever. All right, let's let's eavesdrop on some conversations. Yeah, Subject 17 apparently has an Asian ancestor down the line. Uh, his maternal's mother, uh, grandmother or something like that is Asian or something, according if I just under if according to what she just said, English is a pain in the ass. Uh, let's not be a creep. Canonically, the noob is a dude. However, it's also a self insert for the player, which means if the player is a chick, or non-binary or whatever, you know, whatever you identify as. Yeah, nobody's in here. Just gonna take a quick look around and make sure there's no sticky notes. All right. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. It, that's a wall. That, not a wall, but a support strut. Ooh, look at all that down there. Ooh! Servers. I love this design of a building. Like, genuinely. This is my aesthetic for architecture right here. All right. Now, you sure, sir, you're not going to give me an espresso? Can I... Nothing? Oops. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, fine. All right, let's go back upstairs and poke around. Excuse me. Good Lord.
Edward. Hmm. Sticky note. Please. Delicious sticky notes. Um, nom nom nom. Num, num, num. All right, a level two. I bet that's the map for Havana. Yes, that is the map for Havana. Um, Havana, na, na, na. Ba, da, 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 da. Do 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 <coughs> Oh, she's got a sticky note in there. Hi guys, let me just lurk stare directly at you i'm totally not listening in yeah nope oh man they got a snack bar too man shit we here ah restrooms cut okay. wale Problem with the vending machine? All right, there's my setup with the with John. I love how mine is like dead center in the middle. <laughs> totally not. Totally not a uh, any kind of favoritism happening here. Da -da 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 -da. Nope, can't go in there yet. Can't go in there yet. All right. All right. All right, then. Actually, you're not dead center. It's me and this one over here that are more or less dead center. But, uh, yeah. Alrighty. In we go. Welcome to Animus Omega, Abstergo Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any <coughs> questions, comments, or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie LeMay. You have been registered as part of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neurotransmitters activated. Lively Havana. I've been here once before. It was a truly awful pleasure. See someone you know. No, no, no. Just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. I mean, fair. Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious.
I, lo I love Steed Bonnet. And I love that Edward helped out, like, unloading the cargo. Bartering with Spaniards like they were my cousins. Nothing wrong, Duncan. No, it's nothing. Sand in my hampers. So where's the best squad in town? I'm dying for a quick kip. Or a siesta, should I say. Um, I'm just headed to uh, a public house now to meet some merchants. I could, I could show you the way. Well, lead on. I hope you'll tarry a bit while I conduct my meeting. It'd be a great relief to have a man of your stature nearby in case of a misunderstanding. I can hang about. I might have a drink. Spend it. <laughs> drink. <laughs> well, they don't take kindly to pirates here, do they? Wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch. Ladies. Hola, ladies. You don't know these women, do you? No. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Mean to meet them. No, good to know I'm a married man. Married men are their forte, mate. Ladies. Good morning, ladies all. Kitty! Kitty, kitty, kitty! Kitty, 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 kitty! Pet the cat! Pet the cat! Edward, pet the cat! Pet the cat! Pet the cat! Edward, pet the cat! I wanna pet the cat! Let me pet the cat! I swear to God, Edward, pet the fucking cat! Fine! Zero out of ten. Can't. Uh, zero out of ten. Bad game. <laughs> Can't pet the cat. No, that's not true. Just as you have. This rusty razor is nothing to admire. Even so, I appear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Maybe I'll buy a sword too. We'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils. <laughs> Yeah, you have to actually push the buttons, Yvonne. A few reals, then. I did save your skin. Ah, uh, of course. Cheers. That's a better fit for me. How do you fare? At least I think you have to actually push the buttons and stuff. I don't recall. All right. If I remember correctly, the blades of Toledo are the ones I want to go with. Oop, that's the button I wanted. So, like, okay. These are the ones with the check marks are all the ones that I've purchased. Oh, I see. I see. Fair. Um, British cutlasses, Ezio's swords. These are specific. That's specifically his sword from uh, uh, Revelations. Altier's sword. The Blades of Toledo are a sleek pair of swords that Edward Kenway uh, acquired in the famous city of Toledo. And the Officer's Small Swords, which I believe are the ones that I previously owned. So let's go with these. Yeah. All right. I could purchase some of these, but I will hold off for a second. Let's buy some smoke bombs. Those come in handy. Hunting goods. Eh, nah. Pieces of art. These come in handy, like for for completionism's sake, if I recall. But I'll hold off for now. Yeah, let's go ahead and yeah, I'll I'll just hold off for now. Puff or duff. What are we looking for? Uh, a tavern, a sort of courtyard interior. Mm. My goodness, you're an agile chap. Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. <laughs> yes, a fine way to put it.
All right, there's. Oh, I see. Hold on. Yeah, let's go ahead and synchronize. Havana, na, na, na. I think I see the place. We're not far. Hang tight. Okay, fine. Stop or I'll break your knees when I catch you. Kiss steel, Bob. There we go. We robbed the wrong man, mate. A fellow with dangerous friends. All right, now, before I go meet up with Steed again, I want to grab the collectible glowy thing right there. Oops. It helps if I push the right buttons, doesn't it? All right. Now we'll go bug Steed. Go find Steed, I mean. Mr. Bonnet? How you doing? Duncan! By Jove, you're alive! Of course I am. That filth was no fuss. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Room for all. Time, I'll be just here. Fancy meet no Welshman deep in Dago country. I'm English myself. Biding my time till the next war calls me to service. Lucky King George having a piss pot like you flying his flag. Oh! Oi! Skulk! I've seen your face before. You mates with them pirates down in Nassau. Shut your fucking gob or I'll fill it with shot, you hear me? <laughs> Edward, is it? Oh. Oh. Yeah, hey, I warned it. <laughs> but, uh... You want a dust up? I'll give you one. Seen bigger arms on a bird. Ouch. Come on, Edward. Up, 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 up. Okay, don't go up. Up is not good. Up is worse. Run. Move, move, move. You prick. Come on. Would you fucking... Edward. Smoke bomb, you...
There we go. You saw nothing. Get drop, Edward. Edward. There you go. Shut up. <laughs> All right. We got some shit over here to grab. I. Uh, yeah, no, I'll do. I'll just do story missions for now. Edward, get off the well. Edward, get out of the well. Let's do just do some story missions before I get distracted by everything again. Although I want to pick up, sorry, I want to pick up more smoke bombs to replace the two I just used. Hmm. Gracias, ladies. Good morning, ladies. I went the wrong way. Ladies. Good to see you again. Oh, Steed. Sorry about the swift exit. Bit of a misunderstanding. One heaped upon another. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, mate. This is my doing. I'm only trying to keep these Spanish eyes off me. Oh, it's no bother. Regrettably, the soldiers confiscated my sugar for when you were dispatches. Damn! And where'd they gone? Having the foggiest idea, I'm afraid. I suspect those chaps might, but my Spanish is muy mal dad, so I, I'd rather not ask. Shit! Alright, come on, let's follow them and recover my map. And my sugar? Whoa, and my sugar! Waffles. We'll see what happens. And my sugar. And my axe. Why is pir piratey stuff so zen? Honestly, because pirates are a vibe. Like, anti-capitalism, do what you want, fuck the, the man, you know? They're a straight up vibe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me my eagle vision. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my God. Ladies. Here to go for a walk, ladies. All right, ladies, wait here. I'm gonna go grab this thing real quick. Get, get. All right, this way. Buenos dias, senores. So late. Yes, sir. See ya. We are very sorry. Our captain delayed us. This will be Captain Mendoza. Yes, sir. He's very excited to meet you. Only he must be present for a, a, a hanging. Senor. Hanging? All right, love a good hanging. Yes, sir. Well, if we hear the bell, we may go. Right. How was I?
All right, let's nope drop Oh shoot Yeah, you can pet the cat! All right. <laughs> Yeet. Hold on just a second. Okay, well, it doesn't tell me anymore. But uh, I'm actually going to pause right there, run to the bathroom, take a quick break because it's almost 4 o'clock. Um, Y'all should take a second, stretch, etc. Don't go anywhere, though. Be back in a bit.
All right, there we go. Sorry, I pushed the button like five times and nothing happened. So, you know, say la vie. <coughs> okay. Oh, we're back here. Oh, get off the roof, get off the roof, get off the roof. Okay. Oh, shoot. Get some ladies to help. Ladies. Anything, sir. Captain Mendoza needs only to hang the man, then he will deliver your payment. I don't want the alley in my I want goods, things I can sell, tobacco, rum, sugar. CD, we have much fine sugar. Grace, we took off a fat Englishman last night. Rude. You didn't have to call him fat. Englishman. No, sir. Captain Mendoza will have it sent to you, I believe. You will see. Good Lord. Is that big brute your Captain Mendoza? No, sir. He is El Tiburon. El Tiburon. El Tiburon. That would be El Tiburon, whereas that one is the captain. <laughs> More ladies. I wish I could just hire them all, all at once, and just hand, walk around with like 15, 16 ladies around me. Castillo San Salvador. We'll wait, we'll wait for the captain to go by so that we don't Work your magic, vale. Work your magic ladies Let's pick you up Oh pfft. Rude, okay Well, they're distracted. I'm up here. Edward. There you go. Alright, Edward, get in, get in the, get in the, okay. Oh, is he just gonna... Is he just going to walk away? Well. Are you coming back, sir? Sir? Guess not. Okay, I'll just pick his pocket. Stay out of combat. Can do. All right, so that means not the front door or the side door. Gonna. Okay. Come here. Come here. Come here. Time for you to take a nap. It's fine. Over, up, over, over, up, 
and around. Oh, shoot. You see nothing. Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep. Another. Yes. All right. Come here. Come here. Damn it. So much for staying out of combat. Let's reload that real quick. So I could I could do, I could do better than that. Like I did kill him instantly, but I very much entered combat. <laughs> Uh oh. Uh oh. Nope, it was nothing. It was nothing. We're fine. Uh oh. No, we're not. Apparently, it's illegal to whistle in Havana. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently it's illegal to whistle from the bottom of a haystack. I I I don't get it. <laughs> How dare you yuck my yum. Is that a way in? Oh, I could do that. I could climb the tree and then I could roof the tree to and then go up that way. But I wouldn't get the collectibles. All right, let's let's uh it's Fine, it's fine. Just take a snack. Take a take a snack. Nope. Take a nap. Bum ba da da dum bum boom. You saw nothing. Nothing. He just laid down for a nap. He's fine. Don't worry about it. Is that kind of staying out of combat? That's staying out of combat. Technically. Yeah. Fine. It's fine. You're fine. Okay. Now, because you are wandering. <laughs> Fuckers. All right. And now we'll just loot. Ooh, a manuscript. Documents, manuscript. Interesting. Okay. Fine. Whatever.
Okay. Ooh, hello, sir. Just gonna. Okay. Dude just wanted to go for a swim. It's fine. They're working. They're looking away. So I'm gonna come on. Oh. Yeah, that's right. It's, don't worry about it. It's all your imagination. Ain't nobody here. Nothing here but us, um... Mulch. Bum, bum, bum. Past this guy like I'm supposed to belong here. He looked at the sugar and said, fuck that shit. Horse deed. Like, I'm sure he could have found a way to get all of it out of there. Me, just gonna grab that while I'm here. Cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberating. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no, no, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. I love, I love Steed Bonnet in this game. All right, hold on just a second. Got to mess with Discord. R right, the irony of him climbing on the sign, which is exactly why I did that. <laughs> but yeah, the whole aesthetic is vibes, honestly. Plus, it's the Caribbean, so you know that water feels amazing. Bum, ba -da, ba -ba. Bum, bum. Ladies? Wait, where am I going? This way, right. Bum, ba -da -da -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Bum, ba -da -da bum, ba -dum, ba -ba -da -ba 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 Just wait till we get to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. While it's not pirates, it's there's still a lot of um, a lot of water because it's the Greek Isles, uh, the Greek archipelago. So, you know, of course, you sail all over the place there in that game. 
and the water and the and the, the the water in and the animation is just mm, chef's kiss perfection Alright, before I actually go too much anywhere. That tavern? Where's the tavern door? Tavern? Tavern! Here we go. It's, uh... Ah, right. Okay, that's right. All right, so because you're pirates, you can get inf you can pay bartenders and stuff to uh ooh, hello. Uh you can pay uh bartenders to uh gain information about uh ships worth raiding. All right, I'm going to say screw that guy and try to catch this shanty. Okay. Ooh. I can still catch this guy maybe. Oops. Come on, Edward. Ed up. There you go, buddy. No, I'm not going to free the pirates. I'm busy. Come here. Come here. I told you, come here. Oh, damn. It's, uh, you need to get your ass over here. Yes, I am, and you're running from me. The longer you run, the more you piss me off, the more likely I am to actually just straight up kill you. Damn it. Come here. Buddy, come here. I swear to God, come here. There you go. All right, now actually I forgot to do something real quick. I'll be right back. Sorry about that. And yes, yes, I, I know you love Grease Queen, which is why I told you about it. Prick. All right. Um, but yeah, it, uh, it, Assassin's Creed Odyssey takes place during the Peloponnesian War. So it's not like, you know, modern by any means, but it's, Definitely gorgeous. And before that is Assassin's Creed Odyssey, not Odyssey, Origins, which is in Egypt. Okay, fine. You know what? I didn't mean to do that, but I'll take it. And I'll pick that up. Thank you. And then after Odyssey is Assassin's Creed Valhalla, which is in the British Isles during the Viking invasion, the Norse invasions and raids. I forget the exact year. All right. Right? I mean, the exact, this whole, this whole series is the exact same way. So, like, 
we go from the Crusades to Renaissance Italy to Renaissance Rome to uh oh shit um to Istanbul to um and then to revolutionary uh America then to the same time period of revolutionary America but in New Orleans Pirate, uh, pirate, the golden age of piracy in the Caribbean, um, which is this game. Then after that, we go up to shit. Well, there's, uh, the Maron, the Maron, uh, I'm probably saying that poorly, uh, revolutions in, uh, ha Haiti, uh, with Freedom Cry. And then there's, Rogue, which takes place after that. Oh God, I forget where it's up near. It, there's a lot of ice around. Uh, it's up near. Uh, I think it's like New York and Nor and Canada area. Uh, but it's between the Golden Age of Piracy and Revolutionary War. Um, and then after that, we go to Revolutionary France. Uh, and then from there we go to, uh, uh, go to the Industrial Revolution in London. Um, and then from there back to, uh, Ptolemaic. Istanbul is, uh, was, uh, the final Ezio game. Uh, Assassin's Creed Revelations. Um, so yeah, I think you did miss that because I think it was while you were dealing with some uh, major uh, stuff in in life and could not watch. Um, but then after, so yeah, after Industrial Revolution is when we go to Ptolemaic Egypt, um, where you have uh, Ptolemy and uh 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 shit um what's her name Cleopatra I don't remember I'm blanking on her name uh and then you have and then you go from Ptolemaic Egypt to uh Assassin's Creed Odyssey which is Peloponnesian War Greece and then Valhalla with the yeah so yeah it's you get a lot of variety in really quick succession and from going game to game Mr. Duncan Walpole of England. oh and real quick and that's not even counting the Assassin's Creed Chronicles trilogy in which you have uh shit I forget the era of China and then in uh british ruled india and then uh world war ii era with the bolshevik revolution era of uh russia so i believe he's expecting me si sí, señor walpole entre por favor all right give me just a second dismissing some uh okay Notifications. So what do you call him? Assassin? The man's been at sea for months. Be easy on him. Fair. Governor's Mansion. Good morning, sir. Would I be correct in thinking you are Governor I am indeed. I thought as much. Woods Rogers. A pleasure. The same. 
I must say, my wife has a terrible eye for description. I'm sorry. My wife. You met her some years ago at the Percy's Masquerade Ball. Ah, quite. She called you devilishly handsome. Obviously a lie to stoke my jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> Julianne, our guest of honor has arrived, Mr. Duncan Walpole. Ah. <laughs> Julianne Ducasse. <laughs> I hope your conversion to our order is an honest one. I have no love for assassins, but even less for liars. I have not come to disappoint. <laughs> Up for a bit of sport, Duncan? The old man isn't ready just yet. You've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan, so handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots if you like, get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought inside a man who carried nine pistols. They were a bit in battle, but of his ability to swim, sadly. <laughs> Quite. A little kick, yes? Long for the day where one firearm carries four bullets, and not the opposite. I have a friend in England who may like to James Puckle. He's working on something extraordinary. Magnifique. All right, here's a simple challenge. Try to strike every target before this hourglass empties. Okay. Remember, hit every target within the allotted time. All right. Fuck. Duncan, where are your wrist blades? I've never seen an assassin so ill-equipped. Ah, damaged sadly beyond all repair. Uh -huh. Have your choice. Where did you find all these? <laughs> I did not find them. I took them. These are souvenirs. <laughs> For every assassin he's killed, he's stolen their wrist blades. Two blades, as is the custom, eh? Custom, I. Well, you... technically not a custom. It's more of your of an assassin of a certain rank, but Templars wouldn't know that. Neither would Edward. Techniques. Well, uh, we must. We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly uh, show you what I know. Here. You see, situation is well suited to your skills. Have a go. A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Nothing grandiose, just quick and clean. Show us another technique. Quite ingenious to use bales of hay for cover, don't you think? That's the spirit! Secrecy. The advantage of surprise cannot be overstated, isn't that so? Especially around a blind corner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
sexo para aprender esto. God blind me, that's a clever trick. Your aerial kills have a poetic beauty, despite their conspicuous quality. Would you show us? Is it also possible to deliver a killing blow at high speed? Mon Dieu, such a powerful strike! Fascinating! The assassins have trained you well, Duncan. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. At great risk, I imagine. Betraying the assassins is never good for one's health. Well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. Yeah. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's or a pending acquaintance like myself? I pointed this out uh, before, but uh, just to point it out on this stream, <clears throat> when he's pretending to be Duncan Walpole to uh, the Templars, he has a completely different accent than he does in the rest of the in the rest of the game. Anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she uh, here in Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely Rude. offer them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine Nassau would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that. Grandmaster Torres! Mr. Duncan Walpole has arrived. See. Si. You were expected one week ago. Apologies, Governor. My ship was set upon by pirates. We were scuttled. I arrived only yesterday. Unfortunate. Forgive my caution, but were you able to salvage from these pirates the items you promised me? Uh, yes, sir. I was. Increíble. The assassins have more resources than I had imagined, but not nearly enough to deter us. It is a pleasure to meet you at last, Duncan. You are most welcome. Come, gentlemen. We have much to discuss. Convened at last, and in such continental company. England, France, Spain, citizens of sad and corrupted empires. But you are Templars now, the secret and true legislatures of the world. Please, hold out your hands. Mark and remember our purpose. To guide all wayward souls till they've reached the quiet road. To guide all wayward desire till impassioned hearts are cool. To guide all wayward minds to safe and sober thought. By the Father of Understanding's light, let our work now begin. Decades ago, the Council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look upon these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this observatory, 
a place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility and power. It houses a kind of armillary seal, if you like. A device that would grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there would be no secret. Oh, shit! Thank you for the raid, Vanessa Bob! Hey! How are y'all doing? Thank you for the raid. For our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon. For in our custody. Ad in progress. They raid and immediately get an ad. Some of you are sweaty, not gonna lie. Fair. Can you be sure this one is authentic? Is that a self call out? Assassins will come for him. Indeed they will. It is self call out. Fair. He has delivered. The assassins won't be a problem for much longer. All will be made clear tomorrow, gentlemen, when you meet the sage for yourselves. Until then, let us. It's going pretty good. How's it going for you? Let us find the observatory together. For with its power, kings will fall, clergy will cower. And the hearts and minds of the world will be ours. Hot and sweaty. Got to get ready for the gym soon so that you can get e so that you can get even more hot and sweaty. Fair. That is very fair. Exactly. Yes, well, Duncan. Tomorrow the treasure fleet arrives, and with it your reward. After which we will discuss further schemes. I look forward to it. Excelente. Meet me down at the docks first thing tomorrow morning. These these ads are uh the ads are Dark Souls bosses. The true Dark Souls boss. Twitch ads. All right. Okay, so what we got here? Mission up here. Mandicle Sage. Jukebox rigged. Um, let's do some running around, shall we? Actually, you know what? No, let's not. Um, let's go straight for this mission. I'll do all the running around off the of stream. That way you guys don't have to watch me do all the boring collectible shit. <laughs> right? Edward, I love how they animated his whole bearing, honestly. Right? This is like some Terminator type sprinting. Just sprint your way through an airport terminal. I mean, fair. The sea shanties in this game rock. Pro tag run. Morning, yeah, absolutely. Just over here. Edward. Hello, Edward. I found a man to purchase my remaining sugar. Huh? Quite a coup, I must say. He just called you Edward. Oh, that's the merchant who sailed me here. Out of caution, I gave him a false name. Ah, well done. We'll catch up on it later. Deed bonnet. This way. Here he is. A man both Templars and assassins have sought for over a decade. I am told your surname is Roberts. Is this so? 
But Buttons Creed. <laughs> Fair. According to old tales, the blood of a sage is required to enter the observatory. We have the key. Now we need only its location. Perhaps Mr. Robert. I have yet to actually play Valhalla. Transfer him to my residence. Uh. Yeah, they do kind of loot. If you play this game, you get the sea shanties are on a loop, and so you can't you, you learn them pretty well. <laughs> over one man. Is the observatory really such a grand prize? See, si, singular. The observatory was a tool built by the precursor race. Its worth is without measure. Precursor race. I see. One of your early they really did. The desire to kill the Mayan mentor, Atabai. Were you able to carry out this contract before coming here? I... I was not, no. Too many complications along the way. A pity. But the much you delivered with the blood vial will see that job finished. We ah, resurrected somebody from the time period. The idea. Absolutely! Just a little bit of necromancy to get their shit done. Like this route, Torres. We're exposed. Something is wrong. Stay close, Grandmaster. I feel it too. Do not let them get their hands on the sage at whatever cost. Assassins! Above! They're on the rooftop! Reload, come on. Ow, shoot. Oh, god damn. Okay, come on. Come on, bitch. Let's go. A little necromancy between friends is just, just what the doctor ordered. Check in something? Yes, I have used it. Okay. No snipers. Have fun, Vanessa. Thanks for the raid. On Edward, and yeah, he did bug the hell out. It's yep. Hang back and make this easy on both of us, mate. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to try this again. <laughs> Maybe depends on how forgiving the computer is. The AI, I mean. Stop, or I'll kneecap you. Come here. Come here. There we go. Well 
Well done, lapdog. Quiet. We'll see him to the prisons, Grandmaster. Double the watch. Well, I'll be buggered. What an active day we've had, gents. See, beset on all sides by our enemies. We must be more cautious. I do wish I could remain to see our drama done, but I must avail myself of these winds and sail for England. By all means, Captain, speed and fortune to you. With luck, I'll return myself a governor. And with my idiot king's blessing, no less. Adios. <laughs> As for you, Mr. Walpole, I consider this the first payment in a long-term investment. Gracias. Obliged. I would like you to be present for the interrogation tomorrow. Call around noon. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you for jumping in, even for even if it's just been for a few minutes. Um, I hope you have a good rest of your day. I shall try. <laughs> Excuse me. All right, let's get some upgrades, shall we? <laughs> let's go for, well, let's see what else we got. First off, top off on the ammunition, please. Thank you. Pop off on the smoke bombs. Yes, please. They'll probably have the best out of the available things. But officers rapiers to be better. Well, the French court rate. Eh. I would need that one or that one to be better than what I've currently got because you know this is the gold edition so why not um yeah, I'll go with the all right let's see here three range three stun three damage five stun three range yeah we'll go with these All right. Bienvenido. Adelante. Drop. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to bump into you there. Up, 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 up. Steed. Good old steed God bonnet. Sink me for this pittance. One thousand reals for those maps. That's what? A hundred pound at most. How's a man supposed to become rich in these times with a miser like Torres running the world? Have you ever, um, have you ever worked on a plantation before? You know what I'm thinking? I'd like to see this observatory the governor is going on about. He said it were like a device. I could follow people around and show where they were. <laughs> A ludicrous idea. 
Imagine my wife with such an advantage over me. I imagine what a thing like that would be worth. Sell that to the right person, and I'd be the richest pirate or privateer in the West Indies. I'll catch you up on it. There's a sage in that house I must speak to in private. <laughs> Stay out of combat, kill three guards from stalking zones. Okay. Okay. Come here. Or not. Fine. Come on. Come on. Really? You're just gonna ignore me like that, huh? There you go. Now I just need to stay out of combat. Saw nothing, but you should absolutely come and investigate that, I think. I absolutely think you should investigate that. You know what? Let's just... Doink. And... Open that because we're here. Yeah, already been whistling. Come here, Senor Key Holder. And then we're just going to loot the corpse. Ah, oh, shit. So much for staying out of combat. Okay. Let's just pop that back just a little, just a smidgen bit. All right. I can do better than that. Ooh. Hello. Oh, no. And then, oh, nope, not yet. Are you gonna come and investigate? Yes? No? I mean, you could. It'd be it'd be a lot cooler if you did. Or I can just shank you from behind. That works, too. <coughs> oh, okay, can't climb that. Wait, there was a... Ooh, okay. Do this. Damn it, that's a torch, Edward. Come on. Here. You, sir, saw nothing. Continue your patrol. And... Shoink. Come here. Or not. Fine. 
Oh, shoot. Come here. It's fine. Come in and investigate. It's fine. Come here. It's fine. Come here, my friend. Oh, shit. He sees me. Shit. Just too slow. Just too slow. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You saw nothing, sir. Continue your patrol. Uh oh. This is fine. Damn it. <laughs> Immediately fails. Okay, wrong button. This button. Reload last checkpoint. <laughs> MB, I have immediately failed! <laughs> Has anybody here seen the, uh, the new DuckTales series on Disney Plus? It's really great. You saw nothing. I have performed 10 assassinations. You saw nothing. Carry on your patrol, son. Just gonna pop in here and whistle. Surely that whistle did not come from within that cabinet. Surely you must come and investigate it. Because there absolutely could not be a person inside there with a knife waiting for you. A knife? You saw nothing? He saw, he saw, he saw everything. Okay, reload. He saw everything. Making progress. All right, just gonna sprint right past. Hey, you, come here. I'm gonna slowly dismantle this guy's entire guard staff. Slowly, methodically, and quietly. Gonna... Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and loot you too. It's just, might as well. It's just the polite thing to do. Come here. Come here. Come here. Sorry if I bumped the mic there. Gonna pop. No, pop. There you go. Come here, sir. Okay. Ooh, I have an idea, actually. Don't worry about it. Or you could come investigate. That would work, too. You should totally do that. It'd be a lot cooler if you did. Okay, damn. Fine. Alright, so... I'm gonna bypass the gunner. Don't worry about it. You saw nothing. Okay. Uh, all right. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh, 
and this way. And let's go. Nope. Off the tree. There you go. Up the tree. Up the tree again. Ooh. An already dead soldier. That's a lot of already dead soldiers. Bruh. Get. There you go. What is your true name, Rogue? It's a... Uh... Captain Pissoff. Bien que pauvre Piso. Where is this sage? Did you set him free? I had nothing to do with that. Much as I wish I did. Take him to the ports. Send him to Sevilla with the treasure fleet. Wait now! I delivered your treasures, didn't I? You did, yes. But you robbed us of Duncan Walpole. I mean, fair. <laughs> a despicable display. This tusk part is a ruined man, Caroline. Unfit for life on land, much less at sea. If he goes to the West Indies, it's you who suffer. Father. Father. Come, love. Up with you now. That old muckwood! He's wrong about me! I hope it's so. You believe me, don't you? Can you not see me? Standing out there on the deck of a ship that's sliding into port. And there I am, a man of quality. With a thousand doubloons spilling from my pockets. Like drops of rain. I can see it. Such a tragedy. La cena, cometela rápido. You hungry? Hello, Ade. Now what's your plan, mate? Find the weapon and steal the ship. Que Dios nos ayude. No me gusta la pinta de esta tormenta que se acerca. Parece que se está desviando al oeste, hacia el Golfo. Quizá estemos a salvo. I want to loot the body, Edward. Thank you. failure I failed so let's just you know
unlucky lads. Damn it. Tried to be clever and failed. How dare I try to be clever? Now what's your plan, mate? What I need to do is I need to hide the bodies that Ade left behind before I try to whistle. these all the way back here Gonna... it's fine don't look over this direction it's fine it's fine okay. oh god that was me not thinking oops all right one, two, and done. All right. All right. Now, what's your plan, mate? Surely that can't be a whistle. I must go and investigate. Pick him up. Pick him up. Make him cuddle with his friends. And then... We summon him. There we go. Well done, Ade. Here's our stuff. Hey, take what you need. Won't be a minute. Ooh, some leather armor. There's many prisoners held on this ship. Set them free, and they'll sail with us, no question. Bet. So that's the idea then. Free what men we can, then find a fast ship to flee it. Aye, there's a brigand in the fleet. I'll make my way to it. Alright, what do I have? Kill tw uh, not kill. Free 23 pirates. Alright, can do. Ouch. Out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Would you? Okay, so this guy's a little glitched. It's fine. All right, there you go. Hello, fellows. There's a catch to this favor. Go shame with me. I'd follow you to hell for this, mate. I'd follow you to hell for this, mate. All right. Bum, ba da ba bum, bum, boom. Actually, before I do this, hold that thought. I will be right back. Sorry about that. So we got Lads, if we're to drown today, it won't be here. And we just run right through these ropes, no big deal. Oh, shoot. Hi. Okay. Ow! You know what? <laughs> Take a pistol to the face. It's fine. Alrighty. Both? Both. Hello, fellows. There's a brig nearby just waiting for us to take her. of 18 pirates come on can we climb climb there's a ladder literally a ladder there you go come on can we you know what 
Fuck this shit. Let's go. Get fucked. Going topside. Be ready. There we go. That's twenty three pirates. Hello. Goodbye. Anybody up here? Nope. Okay. That has nothing to do with what I'm doing, so. Face them up front to get no damage. And if I fail to face them, hold brace. Okay. Stay 
It's not looking good. Stay as you go, man. Caution, Edward. Brace yourselves. Look up. The sea rises against us. I have to say, this is one of my favorite. Uh, memories of the, in this game just because I love storms like this just I I love them over there. By God, we pulled this one straight from the teeth of Neptune. I'm Edward. Much thanks for your aid back there. Adewale. Adewale. I love that man. You ever been to Nassau, Adewale? Not yet. By God, she took some knocks, didn't she? I think I'll keep her. All hands up, lads! We're taking this one home. I've made my choice at it. I'm calling her the Jackdaw. A sly bird I loved as a child back in Swanwick. A dark little creature, no? Did it rub you wrong when I took this brig as mine own? <laughs> it was the sort of rub I have learned to enjoy, sailing among faces of such fairness. It's true. Most of these men wouldn't accept you as a captain. So what fair role would complement such unfairness? I'll be your quartermaster. Nothing less. All right. And as quartermaster, have you any immediate counsel for this Tyro captain? Rest and repast would do us good before Nassau. Water for drinking. Hunting for food and repairs. Well reasoned, sir. Hunting, that shall be. We'll find a decent place to drop anchor. Despite a few items in the hold earlier, powder and a few pistols, I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> it's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. Mm. A clutter of lint stalks heaped like tinder, and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder. Closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannon, they might as well be tossed. Clogs, touch holes in need of scraping, corrosion on the bodies, 
barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. For we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts. So worry about your own armaments when it suits you. But don't forget about your jackdaw as well. No, indeed. We'll make it a point to keep this ship and its crew in fine condition. Is a pretty ship. I did not mean to do that. Okay. Captain Sultan himself. Shoot an iguana and air assassinate an ocelot. Easy enough. That's an ocelot in Nicaragua. That's an ocelot too. There's an iguana. There we go. That's what I was looking for. The synchronized button.
Come on, Edward. There you go. That this island? 749625. Let us check. 749625? No. So it's somewhere down here. Okay, probably that island. Yep, 749625. Okay, that's fine. Um, ba -da -da -dum, bum, bum. Bum, ba -da -da -dum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum, bum, ba -da -da -dum, ba 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 Edward the Legend. Sayer Ezio Connor. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Crafting, that's what I'm looking for. I need another ocelot pelt. I need any more iguana, right? It is iguana. Yeah, iguana or ocelot. So I do need a third ocelot. Okay, a third ocelot. Ocelot. Number two. No, I don't want to be done yet. No. Fine, give me the tutorial. I missed. Come on. There you are. Alright, here's my third ocelot. Cool. Alright, now let me get this. I think I can do this up here? Maybe? Oh, no, I see what I see. I see the route. Oh, grab the damn tree, Edward. All you had to do was reach out your hand. Shit, man. All right, and I'm assuming I can't. Nope, okay. About here, can I? Okay, there we go. All right. All righty. And we have another animus fragment here and a letter there. Okay, and then we'll hit the rowboat. I really don't want to have to backtrack to this island, which is why I'm doing all of this now rather than in my free time. 
normally normally what i will do is i will do it all in my own free time uh all these collection stuff but island uh, locations like this that you come to for the story you know it's a bit of a pain to come back to them even though you can easily enough it's just still a bit of a pain so my, in, in small locations like this it you know you might as well just go ahead and do it iguania All right, letter. Horizon, oh, Corazon, oh, Corazon, look to the horizon. Do do bo bo ba ba da ba da. No, I don't want to read that. All right, and yay, back to the ship. All right, let's. Let's talk to some. Let's talk to Ade. Ahoy, Captain. Find what you need. My needs and wants are oceans apart, mate. But I did fashion myself a new holster. All I need now is a pistol to lie in it. Yeah. Taken from the holds, just as you said. A little more than a blowpipe. But they'll do. So, are we rested? Or should we idle a while longer? Best way, Anchor. I think the crew is itching to reach civilization. You'll find no civilization in Nassau. But it's a fine place to be merry all the same. All right. Yeah, I know how to. I've done that. All right. That is where I'm going to call it for the day. Uh, excuse me. So, yeah. Thanks for hanging out with me as I. Uh, brain, as my brain just died spontaneously. Um. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out with me as I played this game. Um, <clears throat> and thank you to the Raiders and Vanessa Bob. I met, I could not shout her out earlier. Um, so let me go ahead and do that. Um, and uh, But thank you to Vanessa Bob and the Raiders that she brought with her. Um, that was a wonderful surprise. Thank you very much. Um, I hope you all enjoyed yourselves at least those of you who are, who uh were able to stay um if you want to watch any more of my streams uh you can go to my link tree down here uh link tree dot, uh link tree uh, slash crimson knight yeah english is hard today i promise um uh and you could go to and in there i have a link to my youtube where you can watch all my prior streams um and uh also in my link tree, you can find links to my socials and uh, where you can follow me for updates um, or even join my Discord where you can hang out with me and my friends. Speaking of friends, uh, these are some of them. Uh, you can check out these amazing people on uh, if you want. If not, you know, it's up to you. Um, and uh, I do have even more recommendations in my link tree if that's a thing you want to check out. Um, thinking. Uh, for those of you who are not my usual audience, um, my stream I stream Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, thir and Thursday. Um, on Mondays, I'm usually playing through the entire Assassin's Creed series. Um, so if you go to my YouTube, you can see me play Assassin's Creed 1, 2, uh, Brotherhood, Revelations, 3, and Liberation. Um, and uh, on Tuesdays, I play, I'm playing through the Tomb Raider series, starting with the classic games from the PlayStation 1 era. Um, and actually, tomorrow, I'll be finishing Tomb Raider Chronicles. Um, so that's an exciting thing. Um, I'll officially be finishing the PlayStation 1 era of the Tomb Raider games, which is exciting. Um, exciting and a little bit sad. But anyway... 
and then every other Wednesday, I on Wednesdays I alternate between uh, playing Watch Dogs and uh, on the off Wednesdays. Um, at least for the time being, I've been doing, I've been crossing over with uh, Yvonne B and Melador219 on uh, where we play various multiplayer games together um, and hang out and have a blast. Uh, but on Thursdays, on Thursdays, I play, I play, uh, what's the full name? Middle Earth Shadow of War, um, which is the sequel to Shadow of Mordor and Lord of the Rings stuff. It's great. I'm really having a lot of fun with that game. Uh, so, oh, wrong button. Helps if I push the right buttons, doesn't it? Anyway, let me quickly check to see if there's anybody worth rating. Um, honestly, I don't have anybody on. Huh. That's weird. Normally I have people who are on. Oh well. Um. Huh. See here. Uh, I wonder if there's anybody playing Assassin's Creed. Nah, nope. All right. Well, I would raid. I would pass on the uh, you amazing people, but I don't have anybody on my follow list who's uh, currently live, and there's nobody who is uh, streaming any assassin any Assassin's Creed games that I'm seeing on the Twitch thing. So that's unfortunate. Oh well. Um. Well. Once again, link tree. Uh, which is Linktree slash Crimson Knight. Oh, also in my Linktree. Uh, if you want to support me directly rather than through the filter that is Twitch, uh, you can, I have a link to my Patreon in there, which is patreon.com slash Crimson Knight, spelled exactly how I spell my thing. Um, and uh, you can, and currently there's only one tier, a dollar a month, um, where you can support me directly. Everything that comes from my patreon goes right back into my content creation um and yeah it's not it's not required just a nice little thing if you want to do it um it's up to you anyway uh i will talk to you all later see you all later um remember to have empathy be kind be safe love yourself and everyone around you and i will see you all tomorrow or whenever i love you all Peace out.